Hello, welcome to, um, I think it's a very um, special edition of my uh, channel because I think, not too sure, but I think this is my 400th beer review. Um, I've put other videos on, but I think it's my 400th review anyway. Um, the beer I've got is a canned beer. Um, I, I looked up on the internet about this one because... <sighs> I was quite interested actually because it's got Polish writing on. Now I perceive this one to be a Polish beer but it isn't. Um, it's actually a Czech beer. And I'll show you the can. It is called Zuba. Here you go boys and girls. Lovely jubbly. Here you go. Now as you can see there it's got a what I perceive, first perceived it as a bull, but it's actually a bison, and Zuba means uh, bison in Czech, so I take it is a Czech beer, this one. And it is from the town of Prerov, one of uh, Czechoslovakia's biggest volume producers of beer, and a lot of their beers are exported as well. And um, I did do a strong beer, which was fermented in open tanks and matured for three months, 6.5%, and I called that Maxim. Um, so I'm not too sure what this one is. As you can see there, great looking can. I must admit, and there's the back side. This, this is rolling in at 6%. Um, it, you know, <clears throat> it does a lot of Polish to me, but it is Czech, apparently. Um, so it's got the, yeah, it's, it's quite good. As you can see there, it's got kind of like something like an 18... You know, you've got to be 18 to drink it. <laughs> so, um, well, I'm, well, I'm older than 18, put it that way. I'm not going to go into my age. It's personal. So let's crack this ring. Like right, we do. Not too sure what we're going to expect from this. It's actually a real... It's quite pleasant. It's got a nice pleasant sweetness to it. There is a nice, pleasant, sweet malt there. I'm picking up a little bit of marzipan even. But you, there is kind of like a sweet malt which kind of like um, gives its impression of its strength. If you know what I mean. Yeah, it smells okay. Yeah, it smells okay. It smells okay. So let's whack her in the glass like we do. She's come out. Quite blonde looking. There we go. Um, quite a clear crystal looking beer. Um, very big, compacted head. Mainly it's down to my, in, in, you know, my stupidness of pouring these beers out. Um, yeah, so to me it looks like a normal bona fide lager. It doesn't, you know, I don't, I don't understand any of that malarkey on the, on the, on the can. So I would say it's like a bona fide lager. Um, you know what attracted was the, you know, the ball. So let's see what we get from the. You getting that sweet maltness again? You getting. You do get that. It's not that pleasant. A, there's kind of like a sickliness in the background, a coininess even in the background. But you know, I'm hoping it'll be quite good. So let's um, top her up more. What we do. So I'm going to go in. So cheers. Mmm, that's, yeah, it's not bad at all, that. Um, it's a little bit cakey, even. It, it, it does taste a little cakey. Um, like, it's, not, it's not that bitter either. Um, 6%, first of all, it doesn't feel like 6%.
there's a nice balance of malt there with the body of the beer. You know, it doesn't feel thin. And I suppose that's where the impression of its strength comes from for me. It doesn't feel thin. It just feels pleasant. Um, and, you know, for me, that's, that's not bad at all. It's a great looking can. I'll keep, you know, that is a cracking can. I do like the look of that. Um, anything English on the side? Not really. No, there's nothing. But it says it's, they say, it's owned by a Polish brewer. Um, I perceive, but I, from what I've gathered on the internet, this is Czech. Um, has it got a Pilsner? No, Czechoslovakian kind of like um, characteristic to the taste. I'll go in one more time. Not really. It's more full-bodied for me than the Pilsner. So I'm going to put this down as a Czech beer anyway. Because it says, um, you get a nice full-bodied, full-flavoured, malty beer here. It is, um, it feels like um, a cereal box in a can, in a way. It feels like um, got lovely malty cerealness going on. There's a little hint of fruit that's there, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't say it's kind of like prominent. It's... Uh, like a bit of blueberry maybe but it's very OT cereal like and um, yeah I really like this one it's a great one one more time for the road apart from what I gather from the smell when it was quite yeah Taste wise, it's great, yeah. It's kind of like um, very organic and nutty. There's a nut there, picking up a nut with the cerealness. It's just great. Lovely, lovely, yeah, lovely beer. Boys and girls, it's a pleasure. Check that one out. I like that. Zuba. Great beer, though. Great beer. Um, Please subscribe, mail them in the comments, as always. <laughs> and I'll see you boys and girls soon. So, in the meantime, take care. Keep enjoying your beers. And I'll see you boys next time. So, cheers.